Hey, hey this, this is the Bing, Bing Brothers, Brothers here, and this is part two of Rama's Guide. Yeah, welcome back, guys. Now, um, I don't think I covered my combo in part one, so I like to cover it right now. Now, as you can see, I just taunted. And pop that ulti. Yes, you pop that ulti, and you pop that defensive ball curl. And as you can see, my brother goes up on the top with his power ball. I, I told you guys that power ball he can go up to the opponent really fast and catch up for yeah. that kill. You can see Ash that uh, she just died because of that aggro of our minions. Because she was attacking me, all our creeps were attacking her. I guess, I don't know, but she yeah. dies anyway. Yeah, that is why the taunt's very good. You guys want to use taunt whenever you guys are under the tower or whenever your opponents are, um, are next to your creeps. When you have a lot of creeps, you definitely want to use that taunt. It's just going to pull that aggro on them. Yes, and let us let us talk about more about Ramus items for late game. Yeah, now uh, for this item build that I was going with, we were doing extremely well. So whenever I'm doing well, I always get my Sunfire Cape before I finish my boots. And uh, I always finish my boots with Mercury Treads. Um, I think they're better, uh, in my opinion. Uh, they're better than boost of swiftness because you don't really need a speed because you got powerball Yes, and plus um, uh, For a really good item for a late game uh, good force of nature or you can get war mog or thornmail for thornmail is really good against uh, DPS heroes um, and Good against ashy and twitch, you know and so on and so forth Yeah, so if you have a lot of DPS heroes on on the opposing team Especially if, if they have at least two or three then I do definitely recommend building a lot of armor on him. I mean, I would first probably get um, uh, Thorn Mill, and then after that, you want to grab Odom. Odom will help you a lot, because if they are all targeting you, it's going to help your teammate by slowing them and uh, reducing their attack speed. That is a fairly good item, I think. And um, as you can see, uh, we got the inhibitor. Um, I'm kind of too far, that's why I back away. It was good for my part. And plus, um, always, always get that inhibitor as fast as possible um, because that super creep is a really, really um, good way for our opponents to stay in base and we can jungle and farm as I wish. Yeah, like I was saying before, guys, um, that my Holti also takes down the inhibitor. I think it takes down any uh, enemy buildings, so um, it's really great ulti. Yes, it. Like I said, guys, it is only seconds, 60 seconds for Ramaz for that ulti. And um, as you see in this gank, it's going to be a pretty good gank, I think. Yeah, I think Nunu is going to come back. Or actually, we're, no, we're no, backing no, right no, now. No, no, Never no, mind. That, that's a gank later on. Um, so, uh, guys, I mean, if there's a lot of casters on your opposing team, you guys should definitely rush either a Banshee Veil... Uh, it depends. If they have like really hard CCs over there, crowd control, then you definitely want to go grab uh, a Banshee Veil. And then after that, uh, maybe Force of Nature. If not, grab Force of Nature first. I'm going to get Force of Nature in this game, so I need that health regen and the magic resistance. Yes, and if you see at my brother's aura, there's this red buff aura that you can get from the Lizard. And the Lizard's buff is actually good. It gives you more damage, and it does an AoE damage to enemy nearby, and plus it slows your enemy. Yeah, now again, we're taking the dragon again. And then Twitch throws down a ward. That lantern, I'm telling you, it is good for DPS heroes and um, good for those junglers to get the lantern. Yeah, and the map awareness is so important. I mean, later on during this gameplay, we'll show you guys why that lantern is so good. And it's going to actually help us win this game. Yes, yes it is. Um, okay, this is the gank I was going to talk about, and um, s soon Nunu is going to go over his end stuff yeah. again. Yeah, you can see right here that like they're tower hugging, so I'm trying to taunt one of them and pull them away from that tower. And there you go, that taunt goes as soon as possible, and we get the kill, um, Nunu goes down, Warwick tries to get Twitch, he backs away, and then he aims for my brother, I 
flash away because of tower aggro and that tower aggro is my brother i go back in i go for the kill and that was fairly good on our part with those two flashes yeah you definitely need that flash to get away and also to initiate and this is why i said that you guys definitely want flash um ignite is also good but then um uh, you don't really want to get the kills with Ramus. You rather no. give your kills to your carries. Yes, th that's why so. Ramus is a good support tank. And the flash, ah, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I know the flash can't get it until level twelve. It's pretty, pretty bad. But then you know, play more LOL. That's all you have to do. Um, yeah, I mean, just play a couple of game guys, and then uh, before you know it, you'll probably be level twelve. And then. If you're level 12, I bet you have enough money to get Ram S. Yeah, definitely. Uh, Ram S is pretty affordable. I think he's in like the 3,000 range, yep. which is not too bad. Um, I mean, I think he's a fairly good hero. Um, he <clears throat> is banned, uh, I heard, from rank matches. Yeah, it's because of that 3-second taunt, which is uh, it's just it's just too good, guys. Yes, another hero that have taunt is Sheen. Um, I think we're going to make a review on Sheen later on, but we're not unsure. But we might make a video on Dr. Mundo because yeah. I am playing as him. I mean, if there's any other heroes that you guys want to see, please um, put anything down in the comments, comments below. below and give us any uh, suggestions for heroes. And, and please then, give uh, us we'll suggestions try to make if it. we can fix anything. Um, and... We hope you enjoy the part two of this tutorial, and um, it will be. I hope it's a really good tutorial about Ramus. Yeah. See, we got to totally just ace the team because of my taunt. They can't get away and they can't go into their uh, their spawn spot. Oh yeah, one more thing, ladies and gentlemen, uh, for your utility build. Um, uh, yeah, for Ramus, I like to go down the utility tree. A lot of people go with the defense. I've tried both, but uh, utility really helps you with the mana problem and the movement speed. So yes, it is it's good. really good. And uh, this tutorial, tutorial is gone. And yeah, like and uh, thumbs up the video, guys. And Favorite this the video. is the Bing Brothers here, and, and we're, we're signing, signing out. out.